Responder spaghetti dinner was held in Pine City today, and it was all hosted by an 11-year-old boy. WENY's Alicia Solorzano spoke with Dakota Rinker and tells us more about the yearly Give Back project that has become even bigger this time around. It all began around six years ago when Dakota Rinker asked his mom if police officers like the snack Ho-Ho's. With some help, Dakota decided to put goodie bags together for police officers every year. This year, however, Dakota wanted to do something different and make an even bigger show of appreciation with a free spaghetti dinner for first responders. So basically, I just decided out of the blue just to come up with a spaghetti dinner. I've basically just been doing this all off of um, what I believed was right. Whether it be the police officers get ho-hos or the firemen get crackers or the EMTs just get hand sanitizer. So it's basically been every little thing. Dakota's spaghetti dinner was held at the Golden Glow Volunteer Fire Company in Pine City. The general public had to pay, but first responders were able to come in and grab a free spaghetti dinner with bread, salad, and a cupcake for dessert. Dakota even recruited some friends from his soccer team to help serve guests. We are still appreciated from not only the older generation, but now the younger generation is starting to appreciate what sacrifices the, between the veterans of the military, the sacrifices of the police officers, the firefighters, all the first responders around. Melissa Rinker, Dakota's mom, credited her son with planning the event all by himself. And she also says he is helping to teach others. Well, let's start you with what is Dakota teaching me because it, he's he's amazing. Um, you know what I see is is the maturity growth in him and an ability to organize um, and still be an 11 year old. You know he can come off as, as a politician, you know expert or like a an adult like person, but he's still very much 11. This is just something that's that's very close to his heart. Dakota says all of the money raised from today's spaghetti dinner will go right back into planning next year's Give Back project for first responders. Reporting in Pine City, Alicia Solorzano, WEMY News.